On this episode, we're talking about the only chemicals that you need to add to your pool before you close it. Okay, I don't know why I just did that. On Facebook, Liz asked, what chemicals do you have to or need to put in your pool just before you close it? Well, thank you for your Facebook question, Liz. And really, there's only one additional chemical you need to add to your pool before closing it, and it's completely optional. But first, just a few days before you close it, you should, one, test the water to make sure your pH, alkalinity, and calcium levels are properly balanced. Because a properly balanced pool will protect you from corrosion and scale buildup uh, that can occur during the winter. Number two, make sure your chlorine level is between one and three parts per million. If you don't use chlorine, just make sure your sanitizer is at its proper level. And finally, shock the pool at night just a few days before you close it. In other words, just add a large dose of sanitizer to bring the levels up. This will make sure that no algae occurs and it'll give your pool one last snazzier shock. And that's all the chemicals you need to add to your pool before you close it. However, there is one more thing you could add and that's today's bonus tip. Today's bonus tip is brought to you by The Art of Pool Care, which is a illustrated downloadable guide that I created that covers everything you need to know about pool care. To buy it, just go to swimuniversity.com art and enter the promo code video to get five bucks off. Now, for some added algae protection during the winter, you can add a startup maximum dose of polyquat algicide 60 following the directions on the back of the bottle. Now, when you add it, just run your pump for a half hour to fully mix it into the water before you drain your pool below the skimmer. Also, the later you close and the earlier you open will help battle against algae, which doesn't actually grow at temperatures below 60 degrees. Now, that is a bonus, bonus tip. There I go winking again. I, I know it's weird. And for more information, of course, you can go to swimuniversity.com. That's it, guys. Happy swimming.